We're in the heart of the Smart Energy Lab today with Canadian Solar's latest and greatest product. But rather than me telling you about this, let me introduce Michael from Canadian Solar. So tell us about your new product. Thanks Glenn, and it's great to be up here in the Smart Energy Lab. Canadians are always excited to do stuff with you. It's the premier Australian training facility. Fantastic, I love it. So this is probably our standard residential module now. 370 watts, black frame, half cut cells. There's some great advantages in terms of better shade tolerance. We've got multi bus bar cells, so you've got a better ability to endure micro fractures if worst case scenario they should occur. People often say to me, what's the advantage of half cut cells? And it's really to do with Ohm's law, isn't it? I squared R. So by reducing the resistance and, and therefore by reducing the current, you get a much greater benefit in terms of the power, minimizing power loss. So it really comes down to Ohm's law. Um, halving the panel, you effectively have two separate panels with three sub modules within it, uh, and there your losses are greatly reduced. So it's a little bit of sleight of hand to get more out of the same thing. Absolutely, you, you're spot on. And some of the other advantages, I mean, with, with half cut cells, if you do get a micro fracture, it's got a lot less distance it can actually travel. When you think of a full cell, it's got that whole cell that it can travel across. Here you've got a lot less, and because you've got the multiple bus bars, you know, up to nine bus bars across here, the electrons are still gonna be picked up in any case. It's just a winner. It's really the way forward. The 370 watt's gonna be mounted on our new COM-T. Uh, commercial and residential uh, tilt system. This one, particular one here, is five degree tilt. The benefits of this over the standard adjustable tilts, which most of the cutters be familiar with, is that uh, it's much quicker to install, uh, it slides along the rail much easier, and there's no more need for earthing, weaves, or grounding clamps. This particular product has got pins, which uh, mean that you don't need to put those uh, grounding clamps on the rails anymore and, and deal with the fiddliness of that. So give it a try, it's, it's really popular, it can be used on both commercial and residential, and uh, let's check out what's going on on the roof. The Com2 is quite easy to install, especially on a roof like this, which is not straight. The screw lines are all over the place, but it didn't really matter. I was still able to get the array nice and straight because of the versatility in the big spans that you can do between the L feet and also because it's L feet on rail I was able to adjust the heights where the roof was uneven a lot. It's nice and rigid. These aren't going anywhere. I'm very confident that they're not going anywhere as uh, compared to other tilt legs can be a little bit more wobbly. Um, it is similar to some other brands that I've installed but it has some nice um, advantages particularly the, that adjustability by using the L foot and the moulded rail like that and also the bit that bites in there so you don't need an earth weave. Yeah, they're good. <laughs>